Okay, all right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm James Iz. Of course, the video is back on again. I mean, I'm back with the video. I'm making a video, you know, I'm making a video right now as we speak right now. As a matter of fact, you know what I mean? Coke Zero in the stomach, and I'm ready to record a fucking video. Call from you and my entire world was changed. Trust that you betrayed. Confusion is still lingers. Everything I love and crush. TikTok has made the average woman famous for some reason. Who is Jen Barganan? Let's look this chick up. Okay, why does she have 3.7 million followers, bro? Who is this chick? Why does she have the flash on while like, she's recording a video herself? You know what I mean? Just, uh, what the f*** is this, bro? Hey, Julie, I don't know if you're following this, which you're not in that cone, but it's gonna hit as a five, and I'm worried to death about those donkeys, okay? It's hitting as a thought, okay? Now, I don't think Lakeland has ever had, and we are only 34 miles away from Tampa where it's going to hit as a spot. It, it may go down to a four, but your donkeys are going to be out in this. And will they survive? Will they get out of the fence? and and cause a huge problem and plus you've got projectiles all over that yard julie you need to i will help you clean it Why up the fuck are you worried about my donkeys i'm pretty sure that they're responsible enough to move the donkeys you know what i mean uh, hopefully they, they didn't actually just leave them there you know just let the donkeys sit there like during like a category five hurricane it would probably just kill the donkeys honestly if we're being honest but but i cannot go in by myself and clean it up but anyway this is this is serious shit and you can thank mr joe biden for this and i'm i'm pissing mad pissing mad that they're doing this to to north carolina and you know what they've done They've gone in there and staked out that land for themselves to get the lithium and the quartz. BlackRock has made a contract. Those people are dead. And then she goes off on a QAnon schizophrenic rant there. Just a conspiracy theory, I guess. I mean, I don't really know what to believe, honestly. Like, I did just watch a video. Like, this dude that lives in Florida talking about the government can control the weather. And she's probably rambling on uh, about the same shit. And, you know, she's blaming Joe Biden himself for doing it. I don't even think Joe Biden even knows where he is right now. But And, and, and your wonderful government that you voted for cause this do you not live in the same country as me i'm so confused like why do you blame me it's like they blame other people oh well uh, you voted for this this is what you voted for so this is your fault really you live in the same country you have the same problems as me why are you pointing the finger and not you know help fix the problem or a solution here like bro like these people are really it's just like all doom and gloom bullshit uh, nobody ever comes up with like a solution you feel me because it's called weather modification yep i knew it that she was talking about that cloud seeding cloud and seeding I'm, anyway i'm i'm pissed, I'm okay. pissed off I'm pissed off. Right. And, and oh yeah wait they don't have any fema money because they've given it all to the illegal so that they can vote for them well that and then uh, kamala harris also just announced that she's gonna send 157 million dollars to lebanon that's what i heard too all right never mind I'm, because if i continue on i'm probably gonna start the sounding like her too but whatever let's just <laughs> Yeah, let's move on to another stupid little TikTok and not actually talk about something serious. No, I don't speak Korean. I'm from Myanmar. I'm from Myanmar. Oh, Myanmar? Yeah. Wow. What do they speak? Uh, I speak Burmese. Burma. Mm -hmm. Oh, I know a word. Okay, well, uh, what do you expect from somebody who's an American, bro? Everyone else outside of the country also think that uh, Americans are fucking stupid anyway. So, what is honestly the point of, of recording this video and posting it onto TikTok? Thank you, boss. Appreciate that. Thank you very much. Oh, oh well. Can I have more lobster or not? Can I have more lobster once you've completed the search? I have to eat all this first. To be clear, the rules are that I have to finish a plate before I go back to the buffet. 
for the lobsters? Yes. We have a sign right there. It says there. one per one. plate. So this man is at some sort of buffet place. And he's just getting all the lobster. Just wasting all that food, I guess. What the f is this bro what are you doing this is what you're doing for content this is what you decide to do for content on the internet is go into a buffet place and record yourself taking all the lobsters let's say you have to eat the plate before you come back though what was that i wasn't even talking to you who are you who are you i wasn't talking to you so this man is just causing problems for no reason the casino who be taking all your money has a problem with me taking some lobster all you can eat stop playing with me so i'm here at the palms in vegas trying to put y'all on to the good spots you know what i'm saying Saying, and the manager comes over to my table like um excuse me are you gonna eat all that the rule said one piece per plate so that's exactly I'm sorry wait a minute is he is he a mukbang like food creator on tiktok bro this man he tried to do the whole setup thing so so he's trying to review this restaurant that's inside of a casino and so he decided to take all the lobster to set it up at his table so that he can record his stupid little tiktok the restaurant people has a problem with that because he's taken all the lobster to record his stupid little tiktok there's no way that like this level of entitlement is is actually rampant like what the f okay wait so his thing is that he just takes the plate of food and then dr drops one of it on the ground and says oh oh well what the appreciate you boss appreciate that thank you very much oh oh well Take my meal, no price limit. Okay, I'll so we'll just thing on the he is playing a character of where he's like this bougie guy, I guess. Uh, listen, like, is like he actually like this? Because okay, uh, luxury connoisseur management, loot. Okay, into Dolce and I don't, uh, I can't tell if this is a character and like he's just trolling or if this is actually who he is. The rule said one piece per plate, so that's exactly what I was doing. I would get one piece, take it back to my table, and then go back and get another piece. Hey, listen, after all that, I ain't even gonna hold y'all. That lobster was busting. The butter has some seasoning at only $80, too? This deal is definitely worth it, but the way that they treated me made me want to leave immediately. You're not supposed to be back here. You're not supposed to be right. back here. You're not supposed to be back here. Please. And that video got 3.7 million views, so... He's wasting food. I think I got a future video on my hands right there. Let's just go ahead and just skip on to the next one. <laughs> if I see a girl eating McDonald's, she's automatically unattractive. That's facts, bro. If I see a girl smoking or vaping or zinning, she's automatically unattractive. Facts, bro. Facts, facts, bro. This dude is spitting. Spitting straight facts, bro. I'm telling you. See a girl getting mad while she's driving, she's automatically unattractive. Having any sort of emotions while uh, driving, bro, that's just so cringe and uh, unattractive, bro. It's giving ick. You know what I mean? All right, so this Reddit user got sent this by their stepmom, and uh, I really need the shit. Oh. Thank God, I'm about to have that Pepto Bismol put in overtime. I'll tell you what, boy. And women are not the same. What? And that is not the same. Men and women are not the Men same. Men and women are not the same. And that is a blessing. And that is a blessing. He provides and protects. I multiply. He is the head of the family. Just saying the basic schmuck, like the uh, traditional family junk that uh, everybody's preaching, huh? I am the heart. Yeah, <laughs> bro, we get it, we get it. Blah, 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 blah. Whatever. Next one. America is ready for a new way forward. We are not going back. We together will chart a new way forward. We're not going back. Together we'll move forward. We're not going back. Forward together. Folks, this has literally been the slogan of the Communist Party for the past 10 years. I'm not even joking. If you go to the Communist Party USA's website. You no, know bro, it's like this series of videos that they're like I make. I usually watch cringe TikToks here, but this is just terrifying, bro. I, I just want to see cringe TikToks. Why is that labeled cringe? My fellow Americans, the time has come today to stand tall and proud of your country. We must unite together. We are one nation that is under the people. We are invincible with liberty and accountability for all. Okay, like, this is more like it, okay? Let's not actually get into the topic of the communism shit. I'm just trying to be, like, an entertaining channel here. Facts. 
thank God it's over. Okay, that was <laughs> that was it. Thank God it's over. All right, bro. Um, yeah, man, that was just another one of those little Reddit cringe videos. I don't know what this is anymore like i like i took a shit mid video if you want more videos like this bro go ahead and leave a like and subscribe down below please <laughs> ah